swear that I will stay here with you. Before we get into the video, don't forget to check out my second channel, Fantasia Plays. I play Sims over there too, and I would love to see you there. Hey guys, it's Fantasia and welcome to episode two of Single Mother. So I actually decided to start the next episode right before she goes to sleep. She is just having a relaxing night with her pasta and she's about to watch the TV season premiere. So I just thought it just felt nice for this style of Let's Play to start it off here. I don't know, it's just a nice way to end your night. So before we get into gameplay, we're gonna do our notification shout out. So this one goes to Cece and they said you should also collect the milk and eggs and sell them on the table as if it's a farmer's market and price them times 300. Yes, we need to do that. So you guys left me amazing comments. Like there's actually going to be, well, I mean, there's one comment of the day, but there's going to be multiple comments shown on this episode because I got to talk about a lot of things. But thank you so much for your comments, Cece. And if you guys want a chance to be in a notification shout out, all you got to do is comment down below. So she is watching her TV season premiere, which is North World. That's what she's watching right now. Just enjoying her pasta. And then she's going to head to sleep. So the twins are fast asleep. Hopefully they don't wake up. Um, but she just got finished with the chicken and guys I am so freaking happy that you guys are excited about this let's play starting new let's play is always kind of like it's like an exciting thing but also nerve-wracking and I was so passionate about this that I was just like oh my god I hope they like it and you guys like it it's so exciting um and I'm just really happy about it thank you guys for all the love on love and support on episode one I truly do appreciate it so so much and I'm so happy you guys love the intro as well so I'm thinking of like going back to to my roots with let's plays yes i've always stuck with storytelling but i used to do these things if you guys have been watching me for a while that intro that you saw in episode one of this i used to do that for all my let's plays and i'm not saying i'll always have it for all my let's plays but like i am really inspired to do that sort of things again so like i may eventually add one for modded if you guys watch that the only one that may not have it is like 100 baby challenge because that's kind of different um but as far as like story based let's plays go i just really like the whole intro thing i used to do it for so long Long. And when I was making the intro for episode one, I literally was tearing up. Like, I, it made me so emotional. But yeah, she's just enjoying this C uh, TV season premiere. Aww. She's excited about it. I mean, he saved the toddler. Amazing. <laughs> All right, so we're done with that tradition complete. Yay. So she's gonna actually wait, wait, wait. Let's. Why do you need. I don't under. Is there no door? Oh, God. <laughs> What the heck? Okay, so I didn't build the original of this house, um, but I just like changed all the furniture and stuff like that, except for the kitchen, which I'm still trying to figure out what the heck I want to do with it. Hello, what is this doing? But there's no freaking door in here. <laughs> what? There's only a door here. Okay, we need to like, okay, I'm just gonna go and put this over here. We're gonna do that. It's a little weird, but sure. And then I'm just gonna knock this wall down. I feel like we need to knock this one down too. Yeah, I'm just gonna have it be more open there. Okay, so now she doesn't have to leave the house just to get around to her bedroom, because that's kind of weird. <laughs> Okay, so she's gonna go to sleep. But yeah, you guys left me so many amazing suggestions. I'm really freaking excited. Um, and I just can't wait. Wait, I was gonna have her go pee, but whatever. She's just gonna go to sleep. This bed gets her energy up really fast. So I'll pick back up when she wakes up. All right, so the plus side of this bed is I feel like, you know, living on a farm, I think she would get up really early, especially because she's doing everything. So now that leads me to another suggestion that you guys have been leaving me. So I actually got multiple suggestions about getting um a farm hand and or you know farm hand or you some people call it what else do people call it she could have a ranch hand some people say farm hand ranch hand basically if you guys aren't familiar with that it's pretty much just someone who helps on your farm so i'm gonna have her go ahead and serve up some breakfast that the toddlers will eat which hopefully they'll eat french toast i haven't tried that out yet or should we try pancakes? Okay, hopefully they're going to eat pancakes because there's that glitch right now. But she's going to make the twin toddlers some food. And while she does that, what are you doing, girl? Okay, <laughs> while she does that, I'm going to go ahead and put up another comment on the screen. So multiple of you guys suggested like a farm hand. And this one just really stuck out to me. I thought it would be really interesting to kind of see. So this one comes from Makeup Gamer. And they said, you know what might help with all the work that she has to do? She could have a ranch hand in the household, of course. Doesn't have to be a guy, but it could. And eventually, slowly, 
could start to have feelings for him. This is such a good storyline and I'm already in love with it. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. And I appreciate you leaving that comment as well. So what do you guys think about that? Um, I mean, she could or could not fall in love with a dude that was a farmhand. Like, who knows? It doesn't even need to be a guy. However, when I was reading these comments about a farmhand, I was like, this is reminding me of a movie. I don't even remember the name of it. I don't remember the name of it. But he, like, th th basically... It was, like, about a guy. He, like, needed a job, and he went to this farm, and he started working there, and then the girl and him, like, the daughter there, like, ended up falling in love with him. Like, they just both fell in love. What movie is that? I think it was on Netflix. I don't know. I was watching movies one night, and I watched that one, and I was, like, in the mood to watch, like, love movies. You ever in those moods? <laughs> but, yeah, so I was watching a movie like that, and it made me think of it, and I was like, oh, my God. I loved that movie, and it just reminds me of that, and I just, I don't know. I thought it was so cute. Okay, you need to go potty, so let's have you do that. The tots are up, you guys. Um, well, she's not. And so she's going to stay sleeping because it is pretty early. But he needed that pee so freaking badly. So he's going to go potty. And then he's going to go ahead and grab himself a serving. Actually, I kind of want to put both twin toddlers in the high chairs. I think that would be so cute for the morning. So, so cute. Um, she's just going to, aw. She hears that he's awake. And she's like, come in and watch him go potty. Okay, every time I see this chair, it just trips me out. Like, this is, this is the chair I'm sitting on. It's so freaking weird seeing, like... Like real life stuff in the sims with custom content kind of love it <laughs> um so yeah like we could get a farm hand i could either well i'd probably make him because just in case she falls in love with him i probably just want him very you know specific <laughs> but maybe she wouldn't fall in love with him i don't know obviously she's still madly in love with her husband who has passed away so i mean you know so we'll see but like she definitely needs the help and he would need to be in the household so we would control him but i could do it where like um you know we don't really focus on him i could even like cheat his needs up you know so he would like we could basically just have him like focus on the farm uh, of course i could tell him to like go pee and take a shower but like you know <laughs> like i wouldn't like focus too much on like his fun and stuff like that just have him like do his job you know what i mean um so yeah, we could do that. All right, so now that you went potty, um, we're going to give him some love. I mean, yes, hello. <laughs> so we're going to hug lovingly. And she just, she's the best mom ever. So, you know, we need to have that be true. So, yeah, I'm thinking about this farmhand thing. I'm excited. There's also some other suggestions that I'm going to be bringing up throughout this video. So that's a fun thing about a new Let's Play is multiple of you guys actually have a chance to get your comments in the video because you guys are leaving me suggestions and there's a whole bunch of new suggestions that I can, you know, do. So yeah, um, should we read a toddler book to him for a little bit? She's still going to be sleeping for a little while, so we may as well do that for the morning. Oh, they're actually going to be heading to... Uh, well, technically kindergarten, which I don't understand, but, you know. <laughs> so, they're even going to have time to... Oh, they're not. They're just going to have to go to kindergarten and not even have breakfast. I mean, they can come home and have the pancakes. But yeah, they're going to be leaving. So, let me get her up. <laughs> I always forget about that. It's so weird. They're just, like, they're just going. Like, bye. Aw. I want to spend the day with them, but it'll be helpful because she'll be able to get started on all the farm stuff. Okay, see, they're off. They're off, you guys. And they are aging up, uh, well, four days. Yeah, four days because we're going to go by her age. So that's what we're going to do. Um, and I, I'm going to keep it on normal because for now anyways, because I do need them to become children so that she can get started on her culinary career, which is going to be super exciting. Um, but let's head out and kind of, you know, cater to these cows. So you're the only one awake right now. Um, but let's go ahead and grab milk and then we'll go ahead and ask about a day and talk to. So we're going to do that. And then you're awake as well. Um, oh, we can't do anything with you. Why not? Uh, taco is too busy. Oh, taco's eating. <laughs> so cute. Okay, you guys still going off? Okay. So they are making their way. I'm still gonna say preschool because I don't feel like they'd be in kindergarten. Um, oh, milk in the cab. We gotta get a photo because I love it. <laughs> I love it. Um, you guys are suggesting, like, other mods. Apparently there's, like, other chicken mods that I was not aware of, which got me really excited. So I need to go and read through the comments 
and figure out what the heck the cow uh the chicken mod is called apparently like the chickens actually like run around which makes me really really excited like i love the chicken coops but like i would love for chickens to run around look how cute they are just trotting <laughs> so here is the stand where we can put stuff like we can put the milk there, which I think we're going to do. It keeps on raining. Like, if you guys know, like, Brindleton Bay is just known for rain, and it sucks booty. <laughs> so, let's go ahead and ask you about Day, and then talk to you, and pet, and how are you feeling? Uh, milk is low, hunger is full. We are good with that, so we're just going to leave it be. We got some milk. Um, oh, now you're awake. Okay, your milk, uh... Your milk is low as well. So let's ask about day and pet. I mean, we can also, of course, feed them so that they'll produce milk. But, you know, they also just produce milk naturally anyways. So that's great. But yeah, I just want to keep up. Ooh, thinking level five. Yay. I just want to keep up with, you know, taking care of the cows, making sure they're happy, everything like that. We need to feed the chicken as well. So she's going to make her way over there too. So we got one thing of milk. I kind of do want to get more milk though, you know, like... I feel like we just should. Wait, what? Oh, she's too full at the moment. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and feed you some cocoa so we can get some chocolate milk because that's cute. <laughs> so we're going to do that. And then let's also, let's feed you. Ooh, let's do some pistachios. We'll do that. So she needs to hurry up with the cows though because we got to get to the chickens. And um, see, a farmhand will be really, really helpful, honestly. So yeah, that would be really helpful for her. Let's feed and let's feed feed all the chickens there we go we can go ahead and grab some chocolate milk love it i think we'll leave it at that so um do we have any gardening oh yeah we got more gardening perfect oh we still have to go and repair that thing realistically no actually i feel like she would try to fix it herself okay can she not get to these so if you guys notice like we're on like the land is very weird here and I don't know if she can technically get to these ones. I may have to get rid of them. Um, because if you guys look, they are floating. <laughs> and it was the only way I could make it work. I think they, they're actually floating too. And I didn't want to flatten the land because of the way this lot is. Like, it's like perfectly built. So I didn't want to do that. Um, the cows worked perfectly, thankfully. But yeah, I don't know. I may have to like, aw. I may have to move the chickens. I don't know what I want to do yet. We're going to figure it out. Because yeah, I don't know if she can like actually get to them properly. I don't know. It's just weird. But let's check for eggs and like see if she can actually like get over there. Oh, whoa. <laughs> Did you see that? Okay, let's have her run over there. The toddlers are going to be back soon. Already. And she's barely done anything. Do we have eggs yet? I feel like we should have eggs by now, right? Uh, they're still not ready to be collected, huh? Okay, well, that's fine. So let's go ahead. What I'm going to do is have her um, harvest the bell peppers. And then we'll harvest. Well, I guess you can just harvest all, right? Yeah, let's just do that. Okay, so you are back. Well, of course, they're both back. <laughs> um, And then, I mean, we should get them some stuff for out here, honestly. Like, there's swings, but let's get, like, a toddler. Like, they have this pool, but let's get a little toddler slide. Okay, so let's go ahead and grab a toddler slide because, like, that's cute, right? Um, And then, honestly... Like, a ball pit can probably fit. Perfect. Yeah, let's just get all this for them. She would totally have that for them. I don't know why that was like that. But anyways, <laughs> so let's go ahead and have you just go and slide. And how come she's there for longer? I don't know. That's kind of weird. But we're just going to leave it. I don't know. Maybe she has, like, some after class thing. I don't know. <laughs> okay. And then I'm going to go ahead and start... Uh, putting, we're gonna put, oh, can we not? Oh, we can't sell the milk on there? That is lame. <laughs> That's what I wanted to do. I wonder if we could put the eggs in there. I don't know. But I mean, she can sell, like, this stuff. Okay, well, you know what? I'll, like, put all this. Why not? Not the cocoa beans, though. Um, and we'll try to, like, sell it for higher, I guess, then. So let's just get all of it. Can I not? Oh, is it because she's still doing it? Okay, whatever. Let me let her finish. Dude, there is a lot. Oh my God. Look at all of this. Damn. Okay, can this go in here yet? There we go. We've also got sage and everything. She has so much basil and now it's raining. So I'm going to go ahead and put this in there. And then, oh my gosh, she's going to have a hundred basil. And we reached level four of the gardening. Yay. Okay, so hopefully she gets done with this soon because it is raining. Um, he's literally in the ball pit. Oh my god, he's so cute. 
<laughs> oh, it's raining. You gotta get inside, buddy. He's having the time of his life, though. I'm just gonna let him. He is having a good time. Like, it's hot out. Like, you know, he's not gonna be cold. Okay. So, let me go ahead and um, view the inventory again. Let me put this in here. Okay. I really wish we could, the milk. we could put the milk there, but you know. Let's go ahead and stock the table. Okay. And then, how do we... Like, I've never done this, by the way, you guys. <laughs> oh, mark up prices. Okay. <laughs> so, you guys are suggesting market up 300. So, um, we're going to go ahead... Well, I, I, she needs a bath. So I should definitely get on that. Um, she's going to leave the table really quick <laughs> and give her a bath because she is miserable. So let's get that bath in. So give a bubble bath to Amy and you should get inside because it is raining and you don't want to get a cold. So let's have you come in here and let's just go ahead and spell words. Okay. So let's get off this table. And I don't know, like, is anyone going to come? Like, I mean, we're on a home lot. So is anyone really going to come? Comment down below if you've used these. Um, who's calling us? No, we're not falling for that. We're not falling for it. <laughs> okay. Anyways, um, comment down below if you use these tables. Have you ever used them like at your home lot? And uh, will Sims come? Like, will they actually come over here? Because I, I mean, I feel like it'll work better on a community lot. But oh God. Oh God. We need to get rid of that. <laughs> But like, you know, okay, I'm just gonna stick it in here for now. But yeah, I just, I, I mean, I want her to do it here. I feel like it makes more sense. Like we're on a farm. People would come visit our farm. But like, it's kind of hard because there's not actually farms in The Sims 4. So Sims are not just gonna come to your residential lot. So I don't know. We shall see. But we're gonna give her the bath. She needs some fun after that. But also, we're probably just gonna have the pancakes for dinner. <laughs> That's what we're probably going to do. So yeah, we'll probably have like a little bit of an early dinner after she gets some fun in um i'm actually surprised she's not oh wait she is getting fun from the bubble bath all right so i'm gonna have her go ahead and just play dolls i feel like that is literally her favorite thing to do is just play dolls um and then landon needs to go potty so he's gonna go she's gonna serve vegetable chili i mean we have these pancakes but sure let's let her do it she loves to cook and <laughs> i feel like she would definitely go make more anyways okay so we have this over here we will go back to it um but there's like so much in the inventory like we definitely like you know i don't know i'm just gonna leave it here i'm very indecisive about the table as you guys can see <laughs> okay but now on to the last suggestion that i have for this episode so this one comes from i think it's just satan <laughs> um spelled differently um at least i think that's how you say it but they said it'd be cool to get an australian cattle dog so it can herd the cows and maybe if you got sheep it could herd them too so i love this idea i think that's a great idea thank you so much for your comment um so i think they would definitely get an australian um cattle dog so they already have dog stuff. I was already planning for them to get a dog. And I think that dog would be the perfect dog. I could just go ahead and make it and create a sim, honestly, um, because there might not be that breed for adoption. Um, and, or we can adopt it and then change the breed, whatever that works too. Um, now I don't think there's a sheep mod though. I don't think, I don't think we can do that. Um, if you guys know of like an actual sheep mod, like not fake sheep, like actual sheep, like kind of like how the cows are. However, the creators for the dairy cow mod, they plan to make more. So yeah, that's perfect. Um, but anyways, um, we just have to wait for that. We need to go ahead and I'm going to put them both down. I'm going to put Landon in here and then put down Amy in here. So let's do that before you eat. All right. So I'm going to have her go ahead and grab a serving for Landon. And then she's going to go grab a serving for Amy. I do really want her to do like the classic mom stuff, you know, <laughs> like put them in the high chairs and stuff, even though it could be you just more complicated high chairs are sometimes frustrating, but I feel like it's just all a part of mothering, you know, be cute if they're all like eating together and everything like that. Oh, wait, I have to get a photo. <laughs> Oh, that is so cute. I don't know why, but just the way the photo is. Oh my gosh, everything. So cute. All right. Um, oh, I look at him. He's such a cutie. It's going to be so spicy for them. <laughs> Love that. Okay. And then you go ahead and eat vegetarian chili. Okay. Are you going to give it to her? You better. Okay. Perfect. Cute. Okay. Eat your chili. Eat your chili. Eat vegetarian chili. 
<laughs> They're so cute. I love them. They're so sweet, you guys. Look at them. Oh, my heart. Okay, so we're eating dinner at a good time. That's great. Um, she literally has a pacifier in trying to eat her chili. Love that. <laughs> Okay, well look at this little family dinner, you guys. All right, she's feeling better now. She just really needed some food in her. Um, so once she eats, actually, let's go ahead and put this away. And then, uh, ooh, they're really, really tired. I mean, yeah, they'd go to sleep soon anyways. Probably like between like 7 p.m. to 8 p.m. they'd go to sleep. So that's fine. Oh, you're getting all, what a good mom, getting him out right away <laughs> before she even finishes eating. <laughs> Aw, so cute. Okay, so he's finished. Um, he's really, really tired. I mean, he could go to sleep a little bit earlier. Yeah, he'll go to sleep. Um, tomorrow's Saturday. He could, he could technically sleep in, but he's like super tired. So we're just going to put him to bed. Oh, look at her. Literally the best mom. <laughs> Taking them both out of the high chair right away. Once they're done eating. Okay, you come and go potty. Okay, so he's coming up the stairs. He's going to go to sleep. And then she's finishing up her chili. And then she's literally going to pee herself. So <laughs> let's go ahead and use... And let me, uh, she's going to go ahead and clean up the plates. Okay, so a successful day on the farm, I would say. The only thing, like, we didn't really get to this stuff. But I don't know if anyone's going to really come. Like, I'm going to try to tend it again, and we'll see. We just, like, we literally live in this, like, private area because of James. Like, he just made so much money on the farm. Like, it's literally gated in <laughs> and everything. So, like, I don't know. I don't know, you guys. All right, so Amy finished going potty and she is super tired now. So she's gonna go to sleep as well. So they're both asleep. Oh, we need to turn on auto lights. That's what we need to do. Um, auto lights, all lights. There we go. Okay, so she's heading to sleep and we are gonna try to get to, you know, reading them to sleep, but we made progress with dinner. They all ate dinner together in their high chair and everything. Mission accomplished. <laughs> all right, so I'm gonna have her come out and tend this table again. And we'll just kind of see also how these cows feeling. Oh, there's a little dog. Oh, so cute. Okay, so um, you're hungry. Um, so, I mean, we could feed you. Let's go ahead and feed chickpeas. And then how do you feel? Um, your milk is low. Hunger is okay. And then you're half full. And then you're sleeping. So, yeah, I feel like no one's... I mean, this sim is here. I wonder if she'll come over here and buy something. I mean, it's just randomly at her door. I don't know what she wants. <laughs> I have no freaking idea. Yeah, I don't know. She, I feel like she's just going to stand here forever in the rain. I'm like, no one's going to come. Like, I don't know, you guys. So, oh, no, wait. Stop doing that. And then, oh, you're, you're busy now. Okay, that's fine. So what I'm going to do for now is just sell everything. And then you guys can let me know. Like, what do you guys think? Um, we're going to sell this, though, because she needs to make her money. Um, she really does. <laughs> Obviously, it'd be helpful, like, if she sold it times 300. Like, should we bring the table somewhere else? Should we do that next time? Um, because we could totally do that. Like, you know, you there is the option. Uh, can't we just, like, okay, wait, clear the table. Clear this. Clear it, clear it. Aw, miss me yet? Aw, guys. <laughs> Um, but yeah, like we can put this in our inventory and bring it anywhere. So should we do that? She could go out places. That could be fun. Oh, I was gonna say we should go, but it just went away. Sad day. Um, like I know he's a ghost, but like we could do that. That'd be cute. All right. So we're gonna go ahead and feed you some rice. Sure. Um, I don't know like what this person wants. No freaking idea. <laughs> Um, and then let's feed you some chickpeas and then, okay, you're fine. So we can go ahead and grab the rice milk. We just got to make as much money as we can. That's the goal here. Um, and you know, she wants to own a restaurant and everything. So I just feel like it's super important for her to do her best. Okay. So let's grab the chickpea milk and then we're just going to sell it here. And there we go. Okay, we've made quite a good amount of money today, I would say. Pretty successful day. Literally from morning to night, she's just busy with the farm. I kind of love it, though. I do really love it. The only thing she hasn't been tending to is these bees. Now, I might have her get into that because it would help her out. It's just, like, I'm scared. <laughs> so, you know what? Come over here. Change into the suit. They're enraged right now. So, 
We're gonna apply the mite treatment and yeah, I don't know. We're, we're gonna try this out, you guys. She is completely unexperienced with us. Also, she's love Lauren because she has a romantic trait. My heart. Aw, she's craving the romance, you guys. Aw, aw. Okay, let's see how this goes. Kinda nervous. Okay, we're gonna, oh no, that was a bad idea. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna collect the honey and collect the beeswax and hopefully it'll just be okay. No. They're so enraged. I want to bond with them, but like we can't. Oh, we can only- oh. What does this do? I don't know anything about bee stuff. Oh god. Oh god. Like, yeah, I just like, I don't know anything about it. Maybe she'll take a liking. Um, okay, that's decent. 72. See, she can make some money from those too. We can sell the beeswax. And yeah, let's sell this other milk. She's just trying to do the best she can. Okay, so we got another cube. Beeswax cube. <laughs> okay, and then let's go ahead and sell this honey. Oh my god, they hate her. They're like, we want James. Who's you? Imposter. Oh my goodness. Okay, so she's gonna get that last thing with the bees and then she needs to just go to sleep. So she's gonna head to bed and hopefully she gets a good night's sleep and then she can get up super early. Did we even get anything else? No, okay, so she's just gonna head to bed and I will put back up in the morning. All right, so it's about to be 5 a.m. and she's gonna wake up bright and early once again. She's gonna take a shower and I think today we're actually gonna go out somewhere. So um, I think we should do that with the toddlers because it's Saturday, so I think that would be good. Um, but we're gonna go ahead and of course do the morning duties. <laughs> so how are you feeling? Um, you're hungry. So let's go ahead and give you some cocoa. Um, and you're fine. And then what about you? You're full as well. Okay, so we can get one milk today and then anything with the plants? Yup, <laughs> so we gotta do some gardening. So let's just go ahead and harvest all and we got to figure out this chicken situation. I don't really know. Like I said, I might have to move them, which would be fine. I mean, like this is fake right here. Um, it's just for like decorations. So, I mean, it gives a vibe, but like it doesn't need to be there. Um, we can get rid of it. The ground is more flat here. So we could potentially put the coops there. That could work. Obviously, like I like that they have their spot over here, but like it's just messed up. I'm just like confused if this is even working because they keep like not having eggs. I'm just confused. I feel like I remember this working differently. Like I played with this before and I don't know. I don't know, but I don't know if it's because of where they are. All right, so she is about to milk this cow, which honestly, I think this one's my favorite because you literally got a heart on your face and I love it. I think it's adorable. <laughs> um, just so cute, like so freaking cute. Um, so we're gonna have some more milk. Um, I don't know why that pasta's in there, but let's go ahead and sell that. And then we're gonna feed you. And then we can grab some chocolate milk from you as well after she does her gardening. So she's off to a good start for the day. The twins are still gonna be sleeping for a little bit. Oh my gosh, but you gotta pee really bad. He keeps needing to pee so bad, really early. Like why? <laughs> but he's gonna be getting up soon to pee. So actually I probably should get him up now before he pees himself to be honest. So yeah, he is always up before his sister. He's a little morning bird, just like his mommy. I mean, she's not, but she's forced to be. <laughs> like, she, I feel like she used to always sleep in and James would get up super early. Okay, let's turn on multi-select and just grab all these. Okay, not bad, not bad. Um, Just for her doing all of this work herself, honestly. Um, but she really, really needs some fun. So we need to work on that. Um, we may go somewhere where she can get fun, at least hopefully. Oh, look at the kitty. Aww. Okay, so probably next episode we're going to get a dog. Um, I think that would be super exciting. Um, we still need to fix these. <laughs> um, we could hire the repair service. Like, would she try to fix these? You know what? She's gonna suck it up and try because they've just been broken. She's been putting it off, you guys. She's like, I can't do it. I can't do this. Oh, we got a weed. Aw, he's gonna watch her garden. That's so cute. Oh my gosh. All right, so I think she's gonna get up too and go potty um, because we're gonna be heading out soon. Um, hopefully we can go somewhere that has something for fun and for food. Okay, so she finished the gardening. So let's go ahead and select the other things that she got. Uh, we got some bananas, yay. All right, so let's sell that, perfect. 
We got 519. Oh my god, wait, what the heck? <laughs> All right, that's cool. All right, and then we got another milk. I think she's doing a really good job. She really is, you guys. Like, she's off to a great start. We're only on episode two. Like, yes, girl, get it. Love, love this for her. She'll weed that later. She's going to just try to fix one of these things. Should she even, you know what? Her fun is so bad. I feel like we just need to go out. Like, honestly, and then you're getting hungry. I feel like everyone just needs to go out where there's like food and uh, why am I traveling with her? I want to travel with the mom. All right, so I really want to go to this Brindleton place market. So if you guys don't know, we are in Simple Unique's save file. If you search that up, she has a YouTube channel and I recently did a video on her save file actually. Um, so that's where we are and there's all these cool lots. So I want to have them go here just because I'm not sure what's here. And we're of course going to bring the tots. If there's nothing here for like everyone, we'll go somewhere else. But I was just curious. Ooh, okay, this is what this lot looks like. It's cute. Oh my goodness. Okay. So there's like a food stall there. And then inside oh, there's an upstairs too. Oh my God. There's like a whole like, look like Sims live up here. Oh my God. Love that. Okay. And then there's like a bakery down here. Oh, this is so adorable. You guys. Aw, I don't know if we're going to stay here. Cause I don't know if there's really, you know, like we need fun and stuff like that. But like, this is cute. We definitely need to come here sometimes. Um, I feel like she'd more come here on her own. So a place for everyone. Let's see. Where should we go? Oh, you guys, this would be really cute to go here. It's a daycare facility, but like we could just say it's like somewhere you can, you know, bring your kids to like have a good time and we'll have everything for them. We can cook here. That would be really cute to go to. All right. Look at how freaking cute this is. When I reviewed this save file, I went here and I was obsessed with it. Look at this sandbox. It is so freaking cute, but, um, let's see. So they're both hungry, but while, so like she can cook something here. Um, let's see. Yeah. She can cook up here. Um, it could, we could just say this is like a community place where you can come and cook food and your kids can play, you know, um, who's this? I don't know. I don't know. Um, but she's going to go ahead and just serve some breakfast and we're going to do something simple, just fruit and yogurt parfait. And then while she does that, the toddlers can honestly, I mean, they can do whatever they want, but let's see. I mean, there's a whole, like, like, look at all of this. They can do tons of stuff. Aw, I may have them come up here because I do have the mod that allows them to draw. So that would be really, really cute. So I think they're going to come up here and draw while she cooks some food. So that'll be super duper cute. But this lot will be perfect to kind of, you know, get away from the farm for a little while and like just focus on the toddlers, you know, because I feel like that's important. So I feel like she likes to get away here to kind of have one on one toddler time. Um, I think that'll be good. Um, even when they're children, they can come here because there's lots of kids stuff as well. So, um, and I feel like she enjoys like cooking here in peace. She's not worried about the animals. She probably gets someone to like watch the, over the farm or something in the meantime. But yes, so she really needs some fun. So we definitely got to work on that. But, um, this is here for them to just grab. I'm not going to worry about them eating at the same time. This is just a chill place. Everyone kind of do what they want. Um, so she's going to eat that. And then, the toddlers are just going to draw for a little bit. And then, um, she needs her fun. So what should she do specifically for fun? I mean, I mean, there is a TV over here. She can literally just watch. <laughs> so we can watch Let's have her watch cooking shows for ideas. I mean, that's perfect. And look how cute these beds are. Oh, I just love it. <laughs> I love this lot. It's so perfect. Okay. Ooh, communication level five. Yay. So they're just drawing over here. Look at this mod, you guys. It basically just allows toddlers to draw. I did do a mod review on it. Um, but if you type uh, Sims 4 toddlers can draw into Google, you should find it. It stretches their legs. But other than that, it works perfectly. And I feel like they should be able to use this thing. Honestly. Like, why can't they? There should be a toddler drawing table. Toddlers love to draw. And like, they could do it where like the drawing is more scribbles. Uh, they really need to make something like that for the toddlers, seriously. Look, look how much fun she's having. It's so cute, you guys. So freaking cute. But yeah, so she's getting really, really hungry. So I'm going to have her go ahead and grab a serving. She'll finish her drawing afterwards. They're trotting over <laughs> to get themselves some food. Where's the bathroom? She's going to pee herself. Here we go. Let's go uh, use. Look at them on the swings. They're so cute. Okay, so she's going to go to the bathroom. And this was such a good day. Well, I mean, it's only 12 p.m., <laughs> We're having such a good day. Like, 
they're just gonna chill. And I mean, we could go somewhere else as well for the next episode. It's still early. Um, you know, everyone feels pretty good. So we could go somewhere else after this. You know, they got their mood up and stuff like that. He needs a little bit of attention, so we can do that. Um, she's a little bit sad from this potty accident, but it's about to go away, so that's good. Um, but yeah, she can go ahead and just play with him a little bit. Uh, so let's go ahead and play and we could head somewhere else So if you guys have any specific lots you want them to go to as a family that you feel like would be perfect For toddlers to also go to then let me know we could go there in the next episode um, Because I don't what's happening? No idea. Um, I don't really feel like they would go home yet. I think they'll go somewhere else. You know, they all, oh, they kind of got their needs up and yeah. So, um, I am literally in love with this family. I cannot, I can't wait to film the next episode already, but I hope you guys enjoyed this one and I hope you guys are all having an amazing, amazing day. And don't forget to leave some positivity down below. I love you guys also so much and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. You gotta listen up, listen up, there's 